guys welcome to the karma side of youtube so this is right after my um awesome shoe pour and what i am doing is i'm doing what we call a dip i don't think i've ever shown you guys a dip so i had a ton a ton a ton a ton of paint left over from the um the shoes because i wasn't really quite sure how much paint to mix for the shoes so I went ahead and I grabbed one of my canvases out, threw some tacks in there, and basically what I'm doing is um, I, I dipped it straight down into the paint, brought it up, and now I'm just taking the excess off the bottom. And look how beautiful. Instant painting. So I am going to torch this. And it's on tax, so I don't have to worry about, um, I don't have to worry about sitting it down in the paint. I really like this. Let's see how many cells I get from, uh, torching it. I'm getting all the air bubbles out so far. That's good. all that many cells but you know I'm not really mad about that because I like the way this looks anyway um I don't really get reoccur a lot of reoccurring cells when I use the uh the all-in-one silicone but I really like it I think it's just beautiful it's just movement of paint guys down here so I have small teeny tiny cells in there I really like that movement it's beautiful you could do this with Yupo and make uh, jewelry as well I'm gonna move this guy over and I'm gonna actually grab another canvas throw some tacks in there and uh, See about uh, showing you guys how I do my little squishy poo. There was a lot of paint on this canvas because I just squished it down in there. And then I didn't try to pour because I really liked the design that came up on it. So I didn't try to pour the paint off. I just kind of dipped the sides in and uh, gave it the same look with the same colors. An 8x8 eight eight thick canvas. Let's do that. Okay. I want to get some of this white in there. So I just squished it down. Oh, really? Just squish it down and then pull it back. That is really pretty, but there's some canvas that's not covered. So I'm going to just shake it just a little bit. Help it along. There we go. Beautiful. Now, what I'm hoping is because I got the white in there, I'm hoping that the white will cause it to sell better. Because we all know white sells really well. And I just dip the sides, and even though there's like some pieces where the sides are not covered, you can always just go in there and just dabity dab dab, dabity dab dab, cover it right up. Okay, grab my torch, see how this sells.
Okay. Again, very teeny tiny small cells, but you guys get the gist. <clears throat> you can get a lot of interesting things going on when you do something like this. Now, for this one, I think I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use this kind of like um, when I flood my canvas. And I'm just going to do, um, I'm going to do two flip cups and see what happens. Because I have a lot of paint left over and why the heebie-jeebies not. So I'm just going to let that run down for a second. And flip. I'm letting the paint run off the canvas just because it's really cool. I really like that. I like all the white right here. I feel like it's going to be lacing when I torch it. I like it. Right now I'm just playing around with ribbon work and seeing what I can come up with because I want to make it a little bit more interesting. Still wanting to make it look interesting, so one of the heebie jeebies not. Let's just go for it. Just do a ribbon here. Maybe one here. Stretch them a little bit.
Now, I think that's done. I think it looks really neat. There's just something about it. it kind of reminds me of like the sky with airplane uh, ribbons going through when an airplane flies. I don't know. Just kind of thinking. Let's take you down and take a look at it. So I'm really digging these cells right here. They happened organically. But there's a lot of lacing in this one. I'm not upset about it though. So there's another one, and I could go on for ages because there's tons and tons and tons of paint here to play with. So I'm going to do a couple more. I might do them off camera though. Um, I think I'm going to do some mini canvases so that I can make magnets out of them. Uh, but yeah, uh, just let your creativity flow when you have this much paint going on. Uh, have a wonderful day, you guys. Thank you for stopping by. Really, really happy. Bye, y'all. Hey, thank you so much for stopping by. If you enjoyed what you just watched, please hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up for a like and hit the bell. That'll give you notifications when I post new videos. I really enjoyed painting today and I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope you get inspired to do all types of things. <laughs> Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye, y'all.